Hello YouTubers, what is going on? Is this going to be a boring video or what? Even if it is boring, guys, you guys should just be patient and take a look on the 40 packs that I have finally discharged them to 2.7 volts. So that is what I have been doing. You guys know that it takes a lot of time to discharge these models. There are 40 of them. Each model carry 150 cells. It do not mean that I'm going to put 40 models in series now. I am actually going to pair up these models. So, since I've been discharging them, I've been writing down the capacities. Making sure that each pack that I'm going to pair it together will be similar to another pack. And guys, look at this. It took me a very long time to select all my cells because I knew I'm using used, I mean, they're recyclable laptop batteries, right? These are cells from recyclable laptop batteries. I know that most of them that have been overused even though all the ones all the cells that i selected 99.99 percent .99 shows that they are good cells because it took me a long time and uh, not just doing everything out of my mind i've learned from people who are doing this and i've put in what i know and i took my time to select it because you know what if you're doing this for your first time done rush you are not running a race with any one take your time select your cells that's why if you see when i discharge my models they are similar to each model because i took my time and select good cells so guys i will recommend you to slow down Take time. It is not an easy job. If you are stepping in there thinking that you're just gonna break up sales, select them, charge them, and do it. Mm. Do it the way you want to do, but I recommend that you should take your time. Make sure that during the charging procedure, touch the the cells and make sure that if any cells that get warm, take it off and put it to trash you don't want to be that guy to be sorry be crying or what a big pack already built and you have a wrong cell on it okay guys look at this i have started to put it on my trunk already so guys in couple days, this vehicle should be driving with 6,000 cells. The most important thing is you see the MG midget. You don't know because you don't know that it is electric. I haven't modified anything outside of the MG midget. So people will not actually know what it is. Thank you very much for supporting guys. Thank you.